What is common between Steve Jobs of Apple, Mark Banyoff of Salesforce.com, and Jeff Wiener of LinkedIn? They are all great CEOs and some of the greatest disruptors of our time. But did you know that all of them were also regular mindfulness practitioners? Today, we live in open source era. Our lives at work and professional level have changed dramatically just in the last five to 10 years. Just in the last five to 10 years, our attention spans have reduced from 12 seconds to eight seconds. Did you know that it is lower than that of a goldfish? If there's a fire, robbery, or an act of terrorism today, people are more likely to take a picture and put it on WhatsApp or Facebook before they call the police. The way they engage, the way they interact, the way they communicate has changed a lot just in the last 10 years. Traditional business models are being obliterated faster than ever in every industry. We are being bombarded with more information in one day today than our ancestors in the 15th century did in their whole lifetime. What does that mean? The changes that we are part of are not evolutionary. They are revolutionary in nature. The things that you took for granted are no longer true. The things that you thought were obvious turn out not to be. The things that you always did habitually are no longer effective. Now in such a scenario, how do you take charge as a leader in your personal and professional life? How do you deal with this level of uncertainty without stress, fear, or anxiety? We believe that the answer is mindful leadership. Now, what does that mean? Number one, we have to redefine leadership in and for open source era, different from the traditional notions of leadership that are based on competency models and psychometric assessments. Number two, we have to understand the science and practice of mindfulness, which is required today more than ever before. It is about self-reflection and introspection, but it is not enough. No amount of introspection can excavate into your thoughts, biases, and motives that are hidden in your depths of your subconscious and unconscious mind. Unintentionally and unknowingly, majority of your choices, thoughts, and actions are driven by them. You need regular practice of mindfulness to get to the deepest levels to understand what's stopping you from achieving your true potential. We will focus primarily on three key pillars of mindful leadership. Power of intention, which is about transforming from living in tension to leading with intention. Power of pause, which is about transitioning from living compulsively to leading consciously. Power of deep self-awareness, which is about becoming the best version of yourself as opposed to a better version of somebody else. Mindfulness is not just a skill that you learn. It is an intimate journey of self-discovery to gain clarity about who you are and then aligning this with what you're pursuing in life. So join us in this journey of deep self-reflection and self-discovery to unleash your fuller potential.